What's up beautiful people, today we're going to be checking out Harrison Ford sends terrifying warning about Hollywood's creepy tactics. Let's get to it. With artificial intelligence for a position of my face for the I don't want to be younger. I don't want to be better looking. <laughs> I just want to tell a story in which it was useful to see Indiana Jones the way we used to see him. What scares me about AI is when it begins to pretend to be a creative uh, opportunity. Hollywood is full of secrets. It's already doing that. And they are slowly coming to light. And now, Harrison Ford has decided to come out and talk about a tactic that is quite creepy. If you were asked, do you think everyone you see on screen is real? Well, according to Harrison Ford, Hollywood is using a new tactic to portray actors. With the development of AI, Hollywood has started using AI to generate various actors. And what's even scarier is that it is so perfect that you can't even tell unless you are told. But what did Harrison Ford warn about these tactics? What did he have to say about it? Let's find out, shall we? The legendary Harrison Ford has revealed Hollywood's tactics that have shocked many people. He has exposed some tactics that have been lurking in the movie industry. In addition to the controversies about the movie Sound of Freedom, more controversies are coming to light. And what's even worse is that all these secrets come from Hollywood's members. Harrison Ford has blown the lid off a new disturbing tactic that Hollywood is using, which is the use of AI to replace actors. And the moment Harrison and background actors too. Ford released this, a full-blown strike was launched. Now actors and scriptwriters all fear losing their jobs to artificial intelligence. With the recent revelation by Harrison Ford, we can say that lines are being drawn now concerning the extent of the use of artificial intelligence in the industry. However, as much as this has been brought to light, Hollywood is divided on using artificial intelligence. This is more so in the context of AI replacing actors and scriptwriters. And as much as there is opposition, there are those who embrace AI in the industry. A great example is the recently released Indiana Jones and the Dial of Destiny. The creators of this movie liaised with Industrial Light and Magic ILM to use AI to showcase a younger version of Harrison Ford in the film. With the support of a team of 100 skilled artists, ILM used its face swap technology to make the 80-year-old actor look younger in the movie. They had to use CGI, machine learning, and geometry from the photography to create a younger version of Harrison, which wow. was used in a 25-minute flashback sequence. So However, convincing. this was not an easy process. They had to use extra cameras alongside the main one to capture all the necessary data for the process. This involves the lighting and intricate details of Ford's face. After that, AI was used to look through older Indiana Jones films and capture some reference images. These would later be used to create matching shots in the Dial of Destiny. And after shooting was done, the experts went through each shot and used face swap technology and machine learning to create a 2D replica of the actor. However, they still needed to create a 3D replica. And so they had to take 3D scans of Ford's face as he recorded different facial expressions used in various scenes. This was necessary to produce the perfect final performance that people would not doubt even for a second. And in three years, all this was done before it was released on the big screen. This is not the first time that ILM has used these techniques. They have applied these to Rogue One, a Star Wars story and The Mandalorian. In addition, ILM is not the only production company to use AI. Others, like the Marvel Cinematic Universe and Martin Scorsese's The Irishman, have also used AI at some point in their films. However, as much as many production companies are embracing AI, designers and VFX artists are concerned about their jobs. And when hmm. these concerns were raised, a full-blown strike by the WGA... Everybody's concerned. <laughs> the actors, the VFX and... and people concerned, everybody's concerned at this point. Even the IT people, the pipeline guys are concerned too. The Writers Guild of America was launched. AI has become one of the main topics in Hollywood's labor disputes and has stirred up negotiations and uncertainties. And when you hear people talking about it, it sounds both promising and threatening. But then again, this depends on who you ask or listen to. Most star actors are now filled with fear of losing control of their lucrative likenesses, while the less popular ones are afraid of being replaced altogether. On the other hand, writers are worried that they might have to share credit or even lose credit to machines. And because of this, both the actor and writer unions have decided to go on strike. 
However, the proposed contracts have a time period of three years. And even though AI has grown faster over the past few years, widespread displacement in such a short time is highly unlikely. But even with that, unions and employers know that when a compromise is made in one contract, a precedent will be set for future negotiations. Right, the use of true. AI has already become widespread. It has been used to produce younger versions of Harrison Ford and even generate abstract animated images. Even streaming platforms like Netflix use AI to recommend what to watch next. Some actors like Jonathan McClain, who is also a writer, have taken the lead in comparing this battle to existing fights over automation in other industries. According to him, there is more to come as technology is still growing. While on the picket lines outside Warner Brothers Studios, he said, it's easy to marginalize what we do because it's entertainment and I get it, but I feel on some level we are, as far as this tech conversation is concerned, a little bit of a canary in a coal mine. This is an important moment, and we've got to really make a decisive stand. However, this is not the first time AI issues have been raised. There has been a discussion between the Screen Actors Guild American Federation of Television and Radio Artists, SAG-AFTRA, and the Alliance of Motion Pictures and Television Producers, AMPTP. At first, it was nothing but a theoretical framework. But as time passed, it became a full-blown strike on July 13th. Later on, SAG called out the studio's stand on the AI position. At the time, SAG claimed that the studios planned on using actors' images without their consent. The claims yeah. became worse when it was said that studios were also planning on changing dialogue or creating new scenes without the informed consent of the actors themselves. And the it technology is available. That's the scary part. It's already available to do that. It went even further when it was said that they were planning on using actors' likenesses and performances to train AI systems without the permission or compensation of the main actors. However, when all this came to light, the AMPTP fought back against these claims and they came up with an AI proposal that would protect the performer's digital likenesses and require the actor's consent before using the digital replicas. This would be the same when it came to altering performances. And as much as they tried to clear the air, the Hollywood big shots wouldn't really care about those below them when it came to this. No matter the results of these negotiations, a specific group of actors will definitely be affected. And to be mm, more precise, definitely. the ones who would feel the pinch would be the working class actors. By this, we mean those actors who take up background roles to build their experience, make connections, and even pay their bills. Right. According to statistics, it has been revealed that about 86% of the 160,000 members of the union can't even make enough money to qualify for health benefits. These are only estimated to be about $26,000. However, it gets even more enjoyable. Some of the big shots in the industry can get top-notch entertainment lawyers who will negotiate contracts that work in their favor regarding AI stuff. However, it is it's all about money. Is the working class actors who would suffer because they couldn't afford the same. This could cause a great problem for them in the future if AI underperforms. If that happened, it would be their reputation on the line, not AI's. Nonetheless, even the big names in Hollywood are getting concerned over this. A great example is Tom Cruise. He recently joined the negotiations to push the producers on SAG after he raised his concerns about AI. However, it is the writers who are more worried when it comes to using AI. In these contract talks, the WGA was willing to use AI to help with its creative process. But there is a great catch with this. They are trying to avoid allowing AI-generated material to be considered literary or source material. This would ensure they get the credits they deserve and are eligible for awards mm. such So AI is really going to take everything. Script writing, background acting, the actors, face swap, um, what is your know, defect, everything. AI is just doing everything. Already this technology is available. That's the scary part. Such as the Oscar for an original screenplay. According to AMPTP, AI-generated material would not be suitable for getting credit for writing. This could raise some concerns, probably even leading to confusion on who gets the credit when collaborating with AI in the writing and creative process. But wait, how can you tell it was written by AI though? How can you tell? Already, there is a lot of confusion when it comes to screenwriting contracts and credits. So when they add AI to the mix, it could probably lead to even worse confusion. And so to prevent any of this, the Guild might have to step in and sort out the fine details and legal language on who gets the credit. The use of AI has led to a lot of strikes, leading to division among people. Not only that, but some people are entirely against it as they fight for their careers. 
And with the revelations made by Harrison Ford, there are a lot of questions that need to be answered. What do you think of the revelations made? And better yet, do you think the industry has tricked us before with this tactic? Feel free to share your thoughts in the comments below. And before you go, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for the best and latest celebrity gossip. Hmm. Yeah, that was an interesting one. Let me know what you think. I, I, I background actors, I, I'm, I kind of feel bad for them because I feel like there's a, a higher than 50% chance that they might take their job because there are tools. I don't know if it's Houdini that already does that, that has crowd, Houdini crowd. One, one tool like that that already does the crowd thing and generates one face and changes, tweaks it to multiple faces and stuff like that. Yeah, so there are already tools that can really do those things. I feel, feel bad for these actors. Yeah, let me know what you think about that one. Um, it's almost inevitable at this point because people keep pushing AI. Yeah, the writing part, chat GBT does everything, like every single thing. Write script better than people these days. You give it a context, it's going to do it for you. It's writing books, as a matter of fact. So uh, I don't know how they're going to regulate or control it. Also, how can they tell if it was written by ChatGPT? I could make a script on ChatGPT, paraphrase it, and then say I wrote the script. How can you know? Probably wouldn't. Anyway, since the end of this video, smash the like button, subscribe if you're new to the channel, and I'll see you on the next one. Have a wonderful day. Peace. I'm gonna hate this bit on my